Listen up, it's college time. Hey guys, it's Elvie here and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about how I prepared for college and my greatest hurdle, which was my mom. Let me tell you some facts about my mom. So she was born in 1951 in El Salvador, and recently she was working two jobs, and she's currently working at MD Anderson Cancer Hospital as a janitor. In El Salvador, she only went as far as up to sixth grade. So she had no higher education, and she really did not understand the importance of education. And my mom is great, I love her. She's a hard worker, and she's always been there to provide for us. But unfortunately, she has her mindset in it's her way, or it's the highway, and then of course, not having enough money around is trouble. Growing up, it was, well, there I want, you know, I want to go to college. But of course, she was like, well, first of all, we can't pay for it, so you're not gonna go. You should get a job, start paying bills, start helping around the house. And then she gives me this ultimatum of, you either go to college or you pick your family. I love my family, you know, I love them to death, but at this time, I needed to improve myself. And I told her, no, mom, I'm going to college. So not only did I disobey my mom by going to college, but then I decided, let's put the cherry on top and I'm moving out of Houston. Hey mom, I'm going to Austin. And so she was pretty upset by that, but then I, I made it clear to her that, hey, I'm doing this for myself. I'm doing this for me. Once I was in college, my mom's disapproval became my motivation and I wanted to show her that I could be successful and achieve and be the best that I could be. So I try to keep my grades super high, just only A's and B's. It was hard because I was working and going to school, so it was just hard keeping that work-life balance. But I did it. Convincing my mom that going away to college was a good idea was such a struggle. It was actually even harder than some of the college classes I took. There were a few things that helped my mom change her perspective about college. One, my sister had to have a couple of talks with her, explaining to her that I wasn't running around doing drugs and that I was actually trying to better myself. Two, that my grades were pretty good and my mom actually got to see my grades. Three, that I was doing pretty cool activities with an organization that I was running at the time. And so when she would see those pictures on Facebook, she would download them and just show her friends and she was so proud of me. These four years have been amazing and have been a great experience. And my mom has actually done a completely 180. Her attitude has changed so much that she's so supportive now. And, and then she tells me, Elvia, you were right. You made the right choice. I'm sorry. So let me tell you this, no matter how many people try to bring you down and if they knock you down, you have to get up and you have to be strong and keep fighting. So whatever it is that you do, don't back down and good luck on your journey. See you out there.